you are not going to believe believe what I've just found here there is a massive owl just sitting literally to me looking straight at me right now straight at me hey buddy stinky morning here in Darwin. This morning I've just come out to East Point Reserve down at the Monsoon Forest Trails. They're about 2.5 k's long, so always remember to bring your water. I'm here to do, just try and do some photography, see if I can get any wildlife, some birds, lizards, or insects. I've got my macro with me, I've got my 600 mil lens, and I've also got my 200 mil. So, we'll see what we can find, just uh, cruising around this little oasis, only seven k's out from the city. All right, let's see how we go. Hey guys, this is really cool. I've just found a bird that's nesting about three meters away from me right now. It's a really good spot to set up too because there's a nice mound which gives me some elevation. I don't know what kind of species of bird this is just yet. So yeah, I better get set up and make this happen quickly. Otherwise he might fly out and find some food for the babies. That's if they've hatched yet. But I'm gonna just keep a safe distance, not disturb the bird. I reckon this is a really good photo opportunity. Okay, all right, let's get this next thing. The worst thing about here in Darwin with the humidity when you're with your camera gear is sweating all the time. And that sweat just goes straight onto your camera gear and that's when you start getting mold on your lenses or inside of your lenses because there's just no way of escaping it. There's just no way of escaping it. I mean, this is such a great find. I'm probably not even gonna go around the tracks and try and find anything else because it is so hot. I'm just sweating so much and um, I've only got two or three hours here so I'm pretty keen to just chill out and wait because to me, this is what photography is all about. Once you find a subject, don't be greedy and try and get all these other things. If you found something that you like, wait for the right moment and take the picture that you're wanting to get. Otherwise you're just fluffing around and getting shit the whole time. <laughs> oh, I'm loving that. Okay, so. Um, I'm pretty happy with that because I ended up getting a shot with my 600mm lens and also the 200mm lens as well. And what I'm super happy about is the fact that I got a shot of the bird coming and going from the nest. The light just shone perfectly, it just came around on the left hand side of the nest and it just sat on that bird perfectly. So perfect amount of light. I mean, I've seen lots of other little insects and lizards and, and birds and all that sort of thing. So, you know, I'll be coming back here for sure. I think this is a great little haven for photographers to uh, to come in and, and just, just, I don't know, sort of, what, we're 7Ks out from the city. So to be able to come into a place that's 7Ks out of the city that has all this wildlife, it's pretty cool. You are not going to believe believe what I've just found here. There is a massive owl just sitting literally to me, looking straight at me right now. Straight at me. Hey buddy. I'm gonna get my long lens, my 600 mil, and I'm gonna try and get a shot of this guy. This is unbelievable. What a beautiful bird. Okay, no more, no more GoPro time. Yeah, one eye's black, the other one's, I think he might be blind in one eye. Definitely got damage to one of the eyes. Definitely. But he looks healthy, he's big. So I'm gonna try and get a little bit closer directly in front of him. Oh, 
how bloody cool was that? He's definitely got one bung eye. Um, it's completely black. So something's happened with that. Uh, it's an old injury, but he seems to be very healthy, very fit, but he is panting because it is very hot. Aren't you, buddy? Is it straight at me? But no, he get, let me get within like two meters of him. And I didn't want to get any closer because I didn't want to scare him off. He's resting. I don't want him to fly off into the heat. I'm stoked with that. All right, time to go now. This time I've got to go. Woo, it is stinking hot. There you go. Monsoon Forest Travel, East Point Reserve. Really cool place. But remember, always bring your water. Especially this time of year, the build up to the wet season. Holy dolly, it is stinking bloody hot. drops now but I don't want to get this this puppy stuck in the wet even though it should be all right there's no point that getting drenched so five more minutes and I'm out of here 